Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for this week I thought I would use a free printable because it's been such a long time since I used one. I was trying to originally use one every single month and that way you guys can find free printables to use as well. And I just, I feel like I've fell off of the horse a bit. So I'm going to be using one this week and it's from um, my lovely planner. I believe it's called, I'll try and link it down in the description box. So if you like the look of this then you can go and download it and use it for yourself. I did cut this out by hand so I didn't use a machine. I just used a ruler and a little craft knife. So you'll see by the end of it, it's kind of really beaten up and because the cuts have gone through the paper and all sorts. But as long as your stickers are cut nicely, it doesn't matter what the rest of the sheet looks like. So I started with the washi at the bottom and I originally was going to use the cutoff at the top but the stickers are a little bit thinner and smaller than my planner boxes so I wasn't able to do that. I did however bring in a few other stickers such as headers and a roll of washi which I actually didn't end up using because this kit is pretty much just washi and full boxes so I wanted to bring in some other elements. The headers that I'm using, the bow ones are what I absolutely adore and they're from Stickers for Keepers and I also found some random glitter headers from Strawberry Lime Designs that match the kit really well so I'm going to be mixing the two of those together. So for Monday I started with one of the bow headers and put down a full box like I said these are a little bit smaller so I just had to center it. I've also got work as usual on Monday so I just put down a little poppet for that and I wanted to mark that I was walking to my parents house after I'd finished work so I just used the little popple Popple? <laughs> Couple poppets. I then took these bunny on the laptop stickers which are from Happy Seed of Star Shop. I <laughs> originally tried to show you what the sticker sheets look like and you can see what the shop's from but I flashed it in front of the camera so quickly all the way through this video that unless you pause it every single time so you're not going to be able to see it. So the um, bunny one is from the Happy Seed of Star Shop and then the little camera was from Planning Dreams and I've just put a little poppet behind there because I wanted to remind myself that I needed to charge the camera batteries ready for my studio vlog that we'll be doing this week. And then right at the bottom there, the multicoloured car stickers are from Handmade Hayward. So moving on to Tuesday, I started with a glitter header from Strawberry Lime Designs. I used a Poppet PC sticker to mark that I'm going to be editing this plan with me. And then the other little things that I need to do to this video, I was just going to kind of list it off. And beside that, I put one of the Poppet Washi stickers. I used another one of the bow headers from Stickers for Keepers and a full box underneath there. And that was to mark down that I will be doing a studio vlog. And then I use a little poppet with the YouTube symbol on underneath. After putting the glitter header down, I put a food shop poppet down as I need to do a food shop. I then took a Lucinda Charlotte Designs foiled bow sticker, which again, you couldn't tell what shop that was from because that was like a 0 0.0 second flash of what the shop was. So I put that down as I need to remind myself to buy my fiance a couple of new shirts. And I also want to send off my poppet pods, poppet, squad packs. I'm sorry, I'm struggling with basic English today. Moving on to Wednesday, I started with one of the bow headers at the top and another full box which I wrote down studio vlog on. So I will be vlogging Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. And I'm really excited because I've got some cool things that I'm doing and I kind of just want to get on and do it. <laughs> I put a glitter header down, I need to return some books to the library, so I used a Scribble Prints Co book sticker for that. The laundry sticker is a random sheet that I think I had in my shop at one point, they're not in there anymore but they're just kind of text on like a swatch of colour, so that's where that sticker's from. I also wanted to post some orders on Wednesday and also send out all of the dispatched emails. Flipping over to Thursday, I've put a glitter header down, a full box, and then I'm using some more of the thinner washi just to cover up the black line. Then I'm creating almost like another half box again by having the two strips of washi and this pop it little reminder post-it note. And on top of that, I'm just writing down that I want to spend some time designing on Thursday. I use another washi pop it sticker as I want to do some crafty things on Thursday. So I've just put that down to remind myself to make time to make sure I do that. I put another bow header down and then a bin poppet as my bins need to go out. I also put a poppet from the home life sheet as I need to do some housework. And then right at the bottom there, I've just put another little YouTube poppet from the social sheet as I would like to have a YouTube binge. And I will be probably be catching up on Love Meg's YouTube channel because I haven't watched that for a little while and I need to catch up with her videos. 
Uh, for Friday, I put down a bow header and a full box that I'm just going to put down for my new release. This week's new releases are going to be another sticker pack. So I had a birthday sticker pack come out a few weeks ago, and this week is going to be this space pack. So we didn't see my birthday pack before, then in each sticker pack you get a little journaling card. You also get a die cut, and obviously this is all space themed, so it's a little poppet in a space helmet, he's so cute. And then you always get some strips of washi that's themed to whatever the sticker pack is, so for this one is obviously space. You also get some sticker flakes included and they are all kind of just random ones that you can place anywhere. They come in different sizes so you'll be able to use them on different boxes or on different days or you can just use them for deco. And yeah, that's all of the little stickers that are included in the pack along with a journaling card and a die cut. So I put the little space rocket down to mark that my space packs will be releasing. I put a glitter header down and another car sticker from Handmade Hayward as I need to sort out a lift to work. So normally on a Friday I drive to work but I'm going to have to find a lift this week. So I put that down to remind myself and then I'm using some more washi to create another half box shape. Because I wanted to create an area for me to write down that my daughter has got a really important exam. It's her final exam for her whole year that she's been doing at college so it's a big exam so I wanted to mark that in my planner and she's got some other exams coming up but this one is like the biggest exam so I put a little puppet shocked face down. It's also my cousin's birthday on Friday, Afia's, so I put down a little celebrate poppet and then from Strawberry Lime Designs I've used one of the petrol pump stickers as I need to put some petrol in the car. For Saturday and Sunday I'm just going to put the headers up at the top and then I was going to be putting down a full box but I didn't want the two pink full boxes next to each other so I just moved that one over to Sunday and then grabbed a blue one to put down on Saturday. Just putting another piece of thin washi down and then we've got the opticians on Saturday, well me, my fiance, my daughter have. So I just put that down with a little doctor poppet. I always use the doctor poppets to mark anything like medical so I've just used that, not that opticians is medical but you know what I mean. I've put that down for that. The organise um, sticker or text sticker was from my shop but they're not in there anymore as well as the, like the homework sticker as well. These were just kind of old random ones that I found in the bottom of a pile somewhere. I then wanted to put down this remember sticker on top of where I had originally put the piece of washi. I just thought it looked a little bit better so I just went and replaced that. And then carrying on with Saturday, they've got homework to do. I've got uniforms to wash, so I put a little laundry poppet down. I put the Hoover poppet down. Sorry, I lost my voice. As I need to change the bag in my Henry Hoover. And that we also want to clean the windows. Moving on to Sunday, I wanted to treat myself in the morning to a nice coffee. And then from the Ginger Cat Co, I took a foiled planner sticker to mark down that I'll be filming next week's plan with me. And for the rest of Sunday, we're kind of just gonna have a chill out day with the family. So I just put that down with a little family poppets or the family of five poppets and just write down chill with the fam. For my to-do section, I just want to make sure I've got the lunches packed ready for the Monday. Flipping over to the sidebar, I used two strips of the foiled washi from Strawberry Lime Designs. I put another full box right at the top and then obviously I had to create my own habit tracker again. <laughs> I've done this several times, but these checklists come out in my shop last week. So I thought I would give those a go because they have got five little arrows which symbolizes Monday to Friday and then I just use one of the poppets from the social sheet to mark what I will be tracking so for me it was Instagram and it was Etsy and then underneath there I just wanted to create a next week section so I use a glitter header and another full box and then these next week foiled stickers from the Ginger Cat Co. To fill up the space at the bottom, also from the Ginger Cat Co, I've got these foiled quotes, which I've had for absolutely ages. So it's really nice to actually get one out and use it in my planner. I know it's gold and everything else is silver in my planner, but we'll overlook that. And then to finish that off, I just used some of my tiny poppets. This is what I've got left. See what I mean about the cuts through the paper, but it doesn't really matter. But that was it for this week's plan with me. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure you give me a thumbs up as it really helps my channel out. Also, if you are new to my channel, then please don't forget to subscribe and also hit the bell notification. That way you'll be notified every time I upload a plan with me or a studio vlog or any other videos that I'll be uploading. You'll never miss out. Hope you guys have an amazing week and I will speak to you on Sunday with the studio vlog. Bye guys.